Writing a research proposal. Importance of research proposal. Guide and steps. What is research proposal? Research proposal is one of the important and more weightage documents for the evaluation of your applications. If you apply anywhere, for scholarships, admissions, in an international university then you have to submit a research proposal. Now here are some questions. How to write a research proposal for master or PhD studies? Research proposal structure. How to write a research proposal outline. Research proposal steps. In fact, research proposal is not only a single document, it is your proposed idea to solve the problems in any kind of challenge and a brief description of the detailed plan with what to do, how to do, and what will be the expected outcomes of this research. If you are interested to avail any international opportunity such as fully funded scholarships in international universities to study abroad, then your all documents must be attractive and impressive with good word selection. Scholarships abroad are very competitive and the selection committee evaluates the applications according to your submitted documents and the validity, value, worth, and feasibility of that documents, a proposal, ideas. Research proposal for study abroad on fully funded scholarships. Importance of research proposal. It is used to establish whether there is expertise to support your proposed area of research. It forms part of the assessment of your application. The research proposal you submit as part of your application is just the starting point. As your ideas evolve your proposed research is likely to change. How long it should be? It should be 2,000 to 3,500 words. 3 to 5 pages long. What should be included in my research proposal? Your proposal should include the following title or topic background and rationale research objectives or research questions methodology research methodology timeline framework plan of work and time schedule references number one is title your title should give a clear indication of your proposed research approach or key question topic selection if you have any innovative ideas then it would be best but if you are confused to choose a topic then follows as first search or research on the internet, Google, Google Scholar and other sources of latest research papers provider. I will recommend you to search in Scopus and read the latest research papers within two to five years related to your research areas. And generate your topic modification by getting an idea from that research. Number two is background and rationale. You should include the background and issues of your proposed research, identify your discipline, a short literature review, a summary of key debates and developments in the field. Number three is research objectives or questions. You should formulate these clearly, giving an explanation as to what problems and issues are to be explored and why they are worth exploring. Number four is research methodology. You should provide an outline of the theoretical resources to be drawn on, the research approach, theoretical framework, the research methods appropriate for the proposed research, a discussion of advantages as well as limits of particular approaches and methods. Number five is timeline framework. You should include an outline of the various stages and corresponding timelines for developing and implementing the research, including writing up your thesis. Number six is references or bibliography. You should include a list of references to key articles and texts discussed within your research proposal, a selection of sources appropriate to the proposed research, sample, Proposal. Format. 1. Sample. Proposal. Format. 2. Sample. Proposal. Format. 3. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. 
Thanks for watching.